guys, how are you doing today? Welcome back to Random Lifestyle Vlog and as you can see we have another advent calendar to unbox. So this uh, beautiful pink thing is uh, the Selfridges advent calendar and I'm super excited to see what's inside because I already forgot. I mean I know I've done a review and I know I liked it but I just I don't remember what's supposed to be inside so super excited about that. Let's have a quick sneak peek at how the inside of the seven calendar looks like it's a uh, pink with some like reddish kind of accents as well uh very pretty not sure if it, this is particularly festive but that's okay i mean it's nowhere near christmas uh, so i'm fine with that right uh okay let's just start with number one which is over here so here we have mac lipstick uh and this is in shade avant garnet really cool because i don't really have this shade and i have many mac lipsticks and i love them Ooh, just dropped it uh anyway i love them uh this is the shade i don't own which is ooh, it's beautiful it's going to be perfect for like winter yeah i like it good start Number two is the tiny one over here, but what's inside is actually not so tiny. Uh, I, this is a Jisoo Honey Infused Hair Oil, 20 mils. And to be honest, I wish I could tell you something about that, but I don't really. Uh, I do have this. I do have this in my hair care kind of um, collection, but I didn't really get to use it yet. So I can't really tell you how good this is from my personal experience. I'm just going to quickly see if this is uh, what, how, oily this is because you know this could be helpful i guess so no it actually absorbs super quickly you don't really see that oily residue here so i guess this is going to be perfect for like any hair types particularly a uh, fine straight kind of like a smooth hair uh if you have more of like a coarse um, hair structure then i guess uh this might be slightly like too light for you uh or you can maybe use this as like a kind of like a styling oil uh so yeah that is cool that feels actually really nice so i'm excited to try it out now maybe i'm just going to put it in my bathroom and just start using it like straight away number three over here so here we have some kate somerville exfoliate uh, intensive exfoliating treatment and this is 15 mils so this is not a full size this is more like a travel size uh, cool i mean i like this product this is like a really quick two minute exfoliating treatment it did not really irritate my skin when i used it which is good um but my skin is not as sensitive as it used to be even though it's still sensitive okay number four up here okay so here we have something from westman atelier i uh recently tried i mean last year i tried a um a lip gloss from that brand and it was lovely and this is what is this it looks like that this is lit up highlight stick oh that's cool that's something different let me just swatch it i don't know if you can see much hmm kind of very it's not very pigmented but it gives you this kind of like a glow with a subtle pinkish kind of hue uh really pretty very natural so uh, it doesn't it won't give you like a very shiny kind of skin effect it's very kind of subtle shine to it so yeah i like it that's quite cool number five is the big one over here and what do we have <sighs> Okay, the classic, Augustinus Bader, the Rich Cream, uh, 15 mils. This is worth like over 60 pounds. So, you know, uh, the value is there, but I have like, I don't know, six of those. And I gave like one of these to like pretty much every member of my family last year. They still have like six. Uh, this is this is a popular product in Advent calendars. And it was super popular last year. And it seems like it's going to be very popular this, where, this year as well. Number six over here. And we have some eccentric molecules fragrance this is molecule 01 uh if you've been watching my channel for a while now you know that i can't really wear these they they smell very masculine on me they should be unisex but i don't know just they don't really work that well with my skin chemistry but actually robert loves them so this is going to go straight to his christmas uh, stocking as well number seven over here Ooh, okay this is what I've been waiting for. We have some Pat McGrath, like, wow. Uh, yeah, having Pat McGrath products and calendars is my dream. And I've never tried any blush. This is Divine Blush. Uh, the, sh the shade is the Desert Orchid. And um, let's have a look. 
That is so pretty. Look at that. Look how pretty it looks. I almost feel bad uh, like swatching it, but I'm going to swatch it. I'm going to show you how it looks. It's really beautiful one. Look at that. I don't think I have a shade like this uh, in my uh, extensive blush collection, so that's even better. And this is a Pat McGrath blush, so I mean, amazing. Okay, so moving on, number eight. It's over here and... Okay, okay uh, so what we have here is uh, Dr. Barbara Sturm, and yes, this is their most overpriced product. This is their Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I wish there was something else from Dr. Barbara Sturm because to be honest, I do like some of her products. Like I do love her glow drops, uh, the li her lifting serum. These are really nice products. The Hyaluronic Acid Serum is just a Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I guess anybody can use that, so that's good. Um, but, it's just so overpriced, so I think it would be much nicer if you had something different here. 10 mils, it's so expensive. If you haven't tried it before, then you'll have that opportunity. Uh, but yeah, I mean, it's just a hyaluronic acid serum, so. Okay, moving on, number nine. It's the big one, and like next to me here. It's quite heavy as well. What do we have? Ooh, okay, I like this one. So we have Ren Clean Skincare, and this is AHA Smart Renewal Body Serum. Uh, this is 200 ml, so very much a full size. And to be honest, I, I wanted to try this for a while now. Um, this is uh, this is supposed to exfoliate and smooth your skin and uh, this was highly recommended if you have uh, those like bumps on your shoulders um on the back of your shoulders uh, i think it's uh, however it's called ketosis pilaris or something like that i'm not really sure how to if i'm pronouncing correctly but uh this is supposed to work perfectly for that so i really wanted to try it for a while now so i'm super glad that it's here and it's like a full-size product so yeah that was a good day number 10 big one over here it feels like it's empty and no it's not empty there are in fact two products in here and they are both from Avida and this is Botanical Repair Strengthening Shampoo and Botanical Repair Strengthening Conditioner 40 mils uh, I mean the shampoo is 50 mils the conditioner is 40 mils uh, I am glad that they put these in uh, one uh, drawer that's that's important, especially if you pay like over 200 pounds for your advent calendar. And I mean, I'm glad that this is not tiny, you know? Sometimes they give us like 20 mils of shampoo and conditioner and what am I supposed to do with that? Like, what? If you have short hair, then I guess doesn't really matter. But for me, yeah. So yeah, that one was good. Moving on to number 11 now. Okay, we are uh, doing some like big drawers now. Uh, so what do we have here? Okay, we have some supplements. So uh, as you probably know, I'm not a massive fan of supplements. I think you, should, you shouldn't just take them as you want. You should always cons uh, con consult your doctor. And I think the supplements should only be taken when you actually need uh, them. Um, the good thing about these is that these are gummies gummies with benefits i like it so i honestly treat them as like some sort of like a sweet thing like sweets you know uh so i am going to eat them because they're sweet and they're probably nice uh these are for skin hydration for the ultimate glow um vegan tangerine gummy hearts so they're vegan that's cool too uh as i said uh oh they contain vi vitamin c and vitamin e as for the vitamin c you can't really go wrong with that um same with vitamin d that's actually recommended uh i guess this won't hurt you but unless you have allergies then you should be extra careful but as i said i'm not super uh, happy about supplements uh you know, than calendars but this to me this is like a like a little jar of sweets so Cool. And surprisingly, we have another uh, item here. This is uh, Vida Glow, uh, six servings of natural marine collagen. Uh, daily essential, promotes glowing skin, smooth spine lines. So, more supplements. Number 12 now. It's over here. And we have another fragrance. Yes. Uh, and this is Viro. Witchy Woo. Oh, I like the name of this fragrance. I wish we had like some sort of box or something that I could just spray it on. Because, yeah, I'm just going to just spray on my skin and fingers crossed I like it. <laughs> I mean, that's like a very kind of old school smelling fragrance to me. Quite unisex. Uh, very kind of like um, wintry, autumnal, quite heavy, deep, dark scent. 
Uh, this is definitely like a shipper fragrance, uh, not something everybody will like, uh, but I'm trying to explore the shipper kind of uh, fragrance family a little bit more, so yeah, that could be a good way to just continue with that. So yeah, I quite like it, I think, but this is definitely not going to be something that everybody will like. This is not like an extremely likable fra uh, fragrance. This is probably going to make you think of like kind of old school uh, fragrances. Okay, number 13. Number 13 is a tiny one over here, and we have something from Milk Makeup. So this is Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Primer, and f for the first time in my life I can actually see this in like a bigger size, because I have like so many samples of this product, like tiny samples. This one is 10 ml, so I guess it's still not a full-size product, uh, but it's so much bigger uh, than uh, the ones I've already got. Uh, yeah, that is actually quite cool. Uh, I like this primer, so fine. I'm glad it's not super tiny, although it's not the biggest one either, but it's not like tiny, tiny, so I can live with that. Number 14, number 14 over here, and we have a face halo. Uh, so these are perfect to remove your makeup. Uh, they are reusable, so that's good. You can just, you know, after using, you can just wash them in a the washing machine. Uh, I've have like three of those or four and this is something I just use on a regular basis so that's cool I have one more number 15 another tiny one over here but we have a fragrance which is good I'm always happy for fragrances and this Alan calendar has so many fragrances that now I remember I was actually impressed by the amount of fragrances the number of fragrances but uh, I know that some of you didn't like that part about it uh, it's just about down to the your personal preference, right? So this is Maison Crivelli and this is Hibiscus Mahajat. I have tried a couple of fragrances from uh, this brand and they were lovely. So I'm super happy to have uh, one more. I haven't really tried this one before. And look at the size, actually quite good. Uh, this is, how big is this? Five mils. Yeah, so this is not like a sample. It's just a little bit bigger and this is perfect handbag size for me. I just keep, I just always have like two or three fragrances like that in my handbag and whatever I prefer to wear at the moment, I just spray them. Oh, that's so pretty. Mmm, this is gorgeous. This is like, a little bit like oriental or like middle eastern kind of fragrance. It's so pretty. Such a beautiful fragrance. Okay, I love this one. I love this one a lot. Um, it's floral, but it's like not your like meadow type floral. It's more like oriental. I love it. That was a good one. Super happy with it. And I forgot what number we were on. I think it was 15, right? Yeah, I think it was 15. So, moving on to 16 now. This one's here. And we have Biosense. So this is Biosense Squalene and Marine Algae Eye Cream. Mm, eye cream visibly firms and instantly smooths. Mm, we do have quite a lot of this brand in Advent Calendars this year. Uh, and I'm glad because I like this brand a lot and this is probably a full-size product, right? Like I don't think they make any uh, bigger eye creams than this one. This is 15 mils and yeah, that's a good one for sure. Rich and hydrating instantly and visibly firms and reduces the look of fine lines and wrinkles. Cool. What else do you need, right? Number 17 up here and we have some Charlotte Tilbury. Charlotte Tilbury is another brand that appears quite often in the calendar this year. And this is uh, Charlotte Tilbury, the Golden Goddess. Okay, so I literally had to just go and check my Charlotte Tilbury collection. Uh, I was 100% sure I had it, but the one I have is actually the Queen of Glow, not the Golden Goddess. I don't know how I could actually confuse them two. Uh, so yeah, I don't have this palette yet. That's amazing. I was so sure I had it. So let me just show it to you. These are the shades, so pretty, I'm excited. So they are more like cool toned, uh, very kind of neutral, and obviously I'm going to swatch them now, because I kind of have to. Ah, uh, that's just super exciting. I honestly thought I had this palette already, but nope, look at that. These are the shades, so pretty. Uh, the lightest one you can't really see on my skin here, but this is more like a base tone, it's over here. Very, very pretty shades, and this is the palette I don't have, so that makes me extremely happy. Number 18 over here, 
And this is Olaplex number three. So uh, I found it yesterday in uh, my uh, Space and Kelvin calendar. Uh, this is 100 mil, so I have another kind of like backup product here. Uh, this is something I use on a regular basis. Um, as I mentioned yesterday, I just alternate this with uh, my uh, Philip King's laser elasticizer. But that's a really good pressure pushing treatment. So uh, definitely most people will be quite happy about it. Okay, moving on to number 19 is over here okay here we have some polish choice uh, two percent bha liquid exfoliant and this is 30 mils so again this is something i found yesterday in my space and calendar, calendar another kind of like repeat and i am pretty sure i had the dr barbarstrom uh, hyaluronic acid serum as well so like three similar products this one is 30 mils a little bit smaller uh, than the one in, Spence, in Space and K, but uh, this is a gorgeous product to unclog your pores. This is perfect for uh, congested skin, for acne prone skin. Um, I use it since I have quite sensitive skin, I use it on my T zone and it just unclogs the pores perfectly. Number 20 over here is it makeup item? Yes, it's by Kylie Jenner. And this is matte liquid lipstick, and uh, this is potentially a full size. I think this must be a full size, right? Uh, I don't think I've ever tried anything from Kylie, but I'm sure I got one of her products somewhere in one of the other calendars this year. Uh, I don't think it was the shade though, and I haven't tried it yet. So this one is in shade, uh, oh god, 707. Maybe the packaging will tell me all about Yeah, uh, close matte. Let's swatch it. So really appreciate. I definitely feel like I want to test it out now and see uh, how good these are. Because I've seen, I've heard quite like mixed reviews about Kylie uh, Cosmetics. Um, so I kind of want to find out by myself, right? Okay, number 21. It's over here. Okay, we have another fragrance. That makes me happy. Uh, so this is... Oh, I know this one and I love it. This is Sana Jardin or Jardin. I'm not really sure how to how to pronounce it. And this is Sandalwood Temple. I love this fragrance. It's like a beautiful sandalwood, uh, sexy, kind of like seductive fragrance. It is just so pretty. And I'm super happy to have it because I actually wanted to buy a full size. I had like a little sample and I liked it so much that I wanted to buy a full size. But, uh, well, I didn't get to buying it yet. So now I will have something that will just keep me going for a bit. Uh, how big is this? Uh, I'm not really sure. And I think this is a five mils. Okay, number 22 over here. And we have something black. We have 111 Skin Vitamin C Brightening Booster. I uh, personally really like this product. Uh, I do like this brand in general, but this is uh, quite a cool thing. It's a booster, so you can actually apply it like directly on your skin or you can mix it with your favorite serum or your moisturizer. And if your skin is quite sensitive to vitamin C, just apply your normal serum and then mix it with your moisturizer. Then you will have this kind of like a uh, layer between this and your skin. Obviously, uh, the vitamin C will be slightly diluted. It won't really work as strong on your skin as it would like otherwise, but it will definitely uh, be less irritating for you as well. So that is actually quite cool. I've been actually using that recently and I actually like it. So I'll have a little backup now. Uh, number 23 now. It's the one here. Ah, a candle. Oh, I just love smelly stuff. So this is the uh, new Des uh, Overos. Yeah, it's a really nice floral scented candle with a kind of strong rose uh, note over here. But it's very pleasant, so that's that, and I think this will this will be again more suitable for like spring and summer. But that's still fine. That's still fine. I have plenty of candles for uh, winter and autumn, so it can wait, right? Number twenty four. And why is it so tiny? It's Christmas Eve, and it's like the tiniest box ever over here. But we do have a good one. We do have a fragrance again. So let me tell you this: this advent calendar is perfect for fragrance lovers. Okay. And this is Le Labo Another 13. I already have this fragrance and I love it. I know most people like or love this uh, Santal 33 or whatever that is. Uh, and I'm not a massive fan. It's like too, it leans too masculine on me. This one is perfect. This one, I really love this uh, fragrance. This is 15 mils as well. Uh, so 
quite a generous size and I'm actually really happy with this fragrance here. So that leads us to our last day, Christmas day number 25, it's over there. Let's see if it's good. It's very light. Okay, so we have three products in here. The first one is a uh, beauty concierge, a special gift for you. So this is like in a Selfridges of Encounter like every single year. An extra special Christmas treat. Enjoy a complimentary beauty service at uh, one of our beauty concierge locations. Blah, blah, blah. So this is like a complimentary 45 minutes beauty concierge appointment. Um, okay, cool. I've actually never used that, but it's there uh, and then we have REM Beauty and these are lashes uh, quite pretty ones as well uh, do you know I, I kind of want to start like wearing lashes a little bit more um, uh, so hopefully hopefully I'll manage to uh, with like my collection growing now and then we have REM Beauty eyeliner in shade midnight black Okay, uh, a full size eyeliner, which is uh, well, that's cool, but at the same time, eyeliner in door number 25. Um, yeah, it's like a pencil eyeliner. I'm not even going to open it because I have so many black eyeliners that, um, yeah, especially the black ones. So, yeah, that eyeliner didn't really, I mean, mascara maybe will be a bit better, don't you think? This eyeliner, uh, kind of like slightly, slightly underwhelming i feel like anyway guys this is everything in this um selfridges uh 2022 advent calendar what do you think i personally think this is a gorgeous advent calendar if you are a fragrance junkie you'll have so many fragrances so many like smelly things you have a nice candle uh so that was lovely i am super excited about the makeup part as well i love that we have like pat mcgrath um uh, blush and then i have this palette which i was sure i had it and i don't so that that is just amazing um i am not super excited about the pencil under the number 25 i'm going to be honest with you but i do feel like there's like a really nice selection of products but you kind of have to like your fragrances, right? I think that this is the, the, the thing about this oven calendar. If you don't like fragrances, you'll be like, well, another fragrance not that exciting i do think it's a lovely advent calendar though i'm super uh, happy with these products over here but let me know what you think uh, do you like it do you think it's a good one or do you think maybe there's too much like uh, fragrance stuff in here thank you very much for watching for more advent calendar unboxings check those videos here i'm going to see you very soon take care bye